Hello, I'm Stormwind Instructor and Cybex author, William Panic. In this video, I am going to show you how to add a Windows 10 Enterprise System to a domain. So, we have just a Windows Server 2012 R2 domain server set up, and we're going to join a brand new Windows 10 Enterprise System to that domain. So, Let's go ahead and start by looking at the actual Windows Server. So we're going to take a look, go into the administrative tools, take a look at the users and computers. And our domain is the stormwindad.com. So that's the domain that we're going to want to make sure that we are a part of. Now, let's go ahead and let's take a look at our... Windows 10 system and on our Windows 10 system first thing I want to do is I want to make sure I'm going to go out to the control panel now what I've done is I've added the control panel to the start menu I like to still go in the old-fashioned way of the control panel if you the control panel by default is not an easy thing to find in Windows 10 you can right click on the actual start button and get into it that way also but I also added it right into my start menu so I'm gonna go in and the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna check my network settings I wanna make sure that I'm on the same network that my servers on so I'm gonna go to my TCP IP 4 and I am on the 15 network. Now, I'm going to go ahead and change the DNS server to 192.168.15.51 because that is the DNS for our domain. I'm going to go ahead and close it down. Then what I'm going to do is inside control panel, I'm going to go to my system. Now, right now I'm set up on a work group environment. So I'm going to go ahead and hit change, and I'm going to change here it asks, you know, to rename this computer or add it to a domain. I'm going to hit the change button, and at this point, I'm going to hit domain, and I'm going to put in the name of our domain. And the name of our domain is stormwindactivedirectory.com, and I'm going to go ahead and say OK. Now it's going to go out and find it, and then it's going to ask me, for an account that has the right to add a computer to the domain. So I'm going to go ahead and put in the administrator account and I'm going to put in the password for that account. And I'm going to say OK. Now you'll know it joins the domain because you'll get a box that pops up that actually says welcome to the Stormwind AD domain. And there it is. Welcome to the Stormwind AD domain. Now at this point, I'm going to go ahead and have to reboot the system for that to take effect. So I can close this down. It's going to ask me to restart. I'm going to say restart now. And it's going to log. It's going to reboot. Come back in. And then at that point, I'm going to have to log in to the domain. So let's go ahead and I'm going to click restart. And now... Let's go ahead and take a look. We'll go back out to our control panel. We're going to go out to our system. And we're going to see now, as you can see here, we're part of the Stormwind domain. So we are part of the Stormwind domain. In this video, I showed you how to join a Windows 10 Enterprise system to a domain. I am Stormwind Instructor and Cybex author, William Panic, and I look forward to seeing you in a class very, very soon.